Hello guys, I hope you are all doing well. In this video, I'll show you how to solve the problem lead called binary search. So let's get started. So the problem is that they give us an array of integers, which is sorted and ascend in order. And they ask us to write a function that return true if we found the target in the array nums, otherwise we return minus one. And also we must write an algorithm with off log n time complexity. So to solve this problem, I'm going to use binary search algorithm and binary search algorithm is a search approach that help us to find an element, an array, or a collection. Also, binary search works only in a sorted array. So let's take an example. Let's say we have this input sorted array and a target integer equal to nine. So here we want to search for nine in the array of integers and return the position or the index. So the brute force approach to solve this problem is by looping throughout the array and each time checking if the number at the i index of the loop is equal to the target. But that's gonna give us a linear time complexity and it's inefficient if we have a large input data and that's why we use binary search algorithm so we take the advantage of that the array are sorted and each time we eliminate a part until we find the targets so let me show how it's gonna work so the left pointer start at the first number and the right pointer start at the end after that we calculate the middle so that we can know which part we're gonna eliminate in the array so we take the left plus the right and divide it by two so the target is the bigger one that means all the numbers at the left must be eliminated and the target is at some position after the middle so we move the left to the number after the middle and we keep the right at the old place means at the end so here we have a sum of the left and the right divided by two which is gonna give us four so we take the number at the position four and we compare it to the target so here the number at the middle is equal to the target that means we found the number in the array and we return true so the time complexity for the binary search algorithm is of log n n and the space complexity is of one since we are not allocating any additional space inside the memory and we are using just variables that's it guys so let's write the pseudo code so that you can take no. So first we initialize two pointers, left start at the beginning of the array and right start at the end of the array. And we calculate the middle of the two pointers. If the number at the middle is smaller than the target, then all the work gonna be on the right part of the array means we move the left pointer to the middle. If the number at the middle is bigger than the target means all the work gonna be on the left part of the array. So we move the right pointer to be the middle. That's it guys. So let's jump at coding the solution. We initialize Initialize left and right pointers, left to be zero and the right to be the length of the array minus one. Then we loop throughout the array using the left and the right pointer. Well, the left is less or equal to the right. We calculate the middle, which is gonna be the left plus right divided by two. Then we set a condition if the number at the middle is equal to the target, we return the middle index. Otherwise, if the number at the middle is less than the target, we move the left pointer to index after the middle means plus one. Else, if the number at the middle is bigger than the target, we move the right to be the middle minus one. Finally, if the target is not inside the array, we return minus one. That's it guys. Thanks for watching. See you on the next video.